All right, now to the fallout from that op-ed about incoming First Lady Dr. Jill Biden, saying that she should drop the doctor title because she isn't really a physician. Many are calling the article sexist, and now former First Lady Michelle Obama is amongst those who have something to say about that. ABC's Rachel Scott has the story. Women are rallying behind Dr. Jill Biden, speaking out against that controversial op-ed, calling for her to lose the doctor from her title. It was this opinion piece in the Wall Street Journal that triggered the backlash. Author Joseph Epstein writing, a wise man once said that no one should call himself doctor unless he has delivered a child. Epstein referring to the future first lady, who has a doctorate in education and two master's degrees, as kiddo, asking, any chance you might drop the doctor before your name? Dr. Jill Biden sounds and feels fraudulent, not to say a touch comic. Former First Lady Michelle Obama saying those comments strike to the heart of what women have been hearing for years. Sharing on Instagram, we're all seeing what also happens to so many professional women, whether their titles are doctor, miss, missus, or even First Lady. All too often, our accomplishments are met with skepticism, even derision. Hillary Clinton firing back. Her name is Dr. Jill Biden. Get used to it. And the soon-to-be second gentleman, Doug Emhoff, writing, this story would never have been written about a man. Northwestern University, where Joseph Epstein had once given lectures, saying in a statement they are firmly committed to equity, diversity, and inclusion, and strongly disagrees with Mr. Epstein's misogynistic views. The daughter of Martin Luther King Jr., noting her father was a non-medical doctor as well. And online, women with doctorates adding their titles to their Twitter handles to stand in solidarity with Biden. There are many things in this world that we can argue and debate about and that there are two or more sides of. But whether we should denigrate women for their professional achievements, that, that is not a point on which we can argue. We should all be able to agree that the time for that sort of prejudice is long gone. Even after all the pushback, the Wall Street Journal's opinion editor defended publishing those words, saying the outrage is overwrought because whether you agree or disagree, Mr. Epstein's piece was fair comment. And as for Dr. Biden, she tweeted this message. Together, we will build a world where the accomplishments of our daughters will be celebrated rather than diminished. Reporting in Washington, Rachel Scott, 13 Action News.